What is up? Here in my mouth. What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Shawnice. I am a mom of three little girls and married to my husband, Jeremy. We have a family channel here. We share a bunch of real lifestyle, family content, um, motherhood, thrifting, um, just everything. Honestly, lifestyle here on this channel. Today, I'm going to be sharing with you guys what I got from the thrift store. Today I went thrifting. I only went to two different thrift stores. Our thrift stores around here aren't the greatest, but when I do find things, I find them. My motivation for going to the thrift store today was to find stuff for my oldest daughter, Jade, her birthday party. She's turning five at the end of May and I'm having a little cute birthday party for her. The theme is farmer's market kind of flowery spring vibes. So I've been looking for things for her part. Um, yeah, so that's why I went out today. And let me show you guys what I got. I ended up finding things for the house because, you know, whenever I find a good find, I'm gonna get it. So the first thing I got was this laundry basket. I love these vintage. Oh, first off, let me say that my style, like my style is a bit of, vintage modern country eclectic farmhouse cottage like i don't know what my style is honestly but i like a lot of different things but for sure vintage like i love all things vintage and that's kind of the direction of my style over the last year um so a lot of things that i do pick up from the thrift store tend to be vintage items and i love it that way because you have a home that is decorated with pieces that are unique and of good quality and I don't know I just love vintage things the first thing is this laundry basket I already have a couple of these already and I always want more especially because there's always piles of laundry waiting for me to be put away so I love for them to be in these baskets they're very durable and they're just I mean, they're cute, they're a vibe, you know? So, got one of these. This one was $5. Sometimes I get them cheaper, especially because I have one bigger than this and I think I got it cheaper than this, so. But anyways, I like it, so I got this one. So I got this little bell, it's so cute. Thought it was the cutest thing. The girls like ringing my bell that I have for the kitchen. So I figured, you know, might as well get this for them, they could play with it, and it was only $1.50, so. This could go with their play kitchen or something. So on to a couple things that I got for Jade's party. I found this basket. The idea I have for her party is very like basket forward, fruit baskets, vegetable container, you know, the, that sort of look. And so I've been looking for more baskets. I already have a ton of baskets that I'm going to use that I've already had but I've been looking for just other things that I could either put flowers in or just, you know, I wanna have a lot of options. So I grabbed this. I'm not too thrilled with the little bow in the front, but I mean, I guess I could always take that off or even take the fabric out um, cause it's not like stuck there, but definitely like this to be able to like hang if I have like a backdrop or something for her like dessert table you know and i also found this very cute and adorable stool it's like a rattan wicker sort of stool um it is not very functional to sit on because at the the base of it is kind of broken and wobbly but i didn't buy it for it to be sat on anyways like this is going to be something to maybe hold something <laughs> for her table or you know her um dessert table um just to give things height like i love when you know uh gosh what is it called um dessert tables and like the focal point of parties where you know you have the cake and everything but i love when there's height to the table so i figured this would be cute and also match the vibe to give a bit of height and I could put something on it. I'm not sure what yet, but I'll figure something out. 
but it was cute and this one was only five dollars this basket was two dollars so as as if i don't have enough glasses like drinking glasses already i had to get these like these are the cutest thing and i so wish i really really wish they had more they only had two in this size and then they had one that was smaller and then one that was bigger and i just it, it wouldn't have made sense for me to get the others i don't know but i just felt like two is enough most likely i'm gonna be the only one drinking out of this like jeremy's probably not gonna be drinking out of a glass that has like flowers and and <laughs> girly little details on it so got both of those and i'll probably have these with i don't know one of my girlfriends or one of my sisters when they're over but i love these and then they would look so cute in my hutch so had to get these these were a dollar 99 each staying with the kitchen items um i got this like little cooking dish i guess a serving dish i'm not sure if it's oven safe or even stove safe but either way it would be cute to serve things out of and it's a very springy summery vibe with the with the very cute flower details so cute very clean and well kept still in really good condition and i always love thrifting things that look like this now you can't tell me that this is not the cutest picture you've ever seen i i almost sprinted down the aisle to get this before somebody jumped in front of me i love this so much and i cannot wait to use this like this could be used either as just decor if i didn't plan to use it use it for serving use it as a vase for my flowers like i had to get this this is so cute to me and this was only three dollars isn't that just oh is it an adorable now my Salvation Army that I go to, um, honestly all the Salvation Armies I've been to that are pretty local to me have a lot of Zara items and they're brand new, like they always have the tag on them and I thought these were the cutest little sandals. They have like the little tassels on top of it and the regular price for these are $69.90, 70 bucks, and I got these for $19.99. A little pricey for thrifted shoes, but the fact that they're brand new is, is okay to me, you know? You cannot beat that, but love them. Can't wait to wear these. This next item I thrifted online. Um, it's actually a lady that I met from the Great Junk Hunt that I went to a few months back she has her own thrift shop and she always like finds very cute pieces and she recently found a bunch of these little brooms and um i hit her up right when i saw it and i was like i want one please save me one and so she ended up sending it over and i you know um i paid for it and i just love this these are the types of things that i love when i talk about vintage like this is functional and it's a great decor piece and i usually have it hanging over here on my little what's that called i don't know what that's called but like i love for things to be functional and also beautiful as a display her uh shop is called bungalow biz i believe yeah bungalow biz i'll link it in the description so this is also what i got from the thrift store today i got two of these little short outdoor sort of tables the only reason i got this is really for jade's party so i want to have like those long tables that you know like the floor tables that are like decked out with like table settings placemats and centerpieces and a bunch of things like that that is my plan my thrift store salvation army always has these but today they only had two i want to get a couple more so that it could be like a really long table you know for all the kids to sit around and like be on the grass and just like be such a cute vibe you know so that's my plan these were each thirty dollars and they're in really really good condition if not brand new honestly but definitely was excited about that because my plan at first was to make my own tables but 
since finding these, now I don't have to worry about that and that's all taken care of. I just have to find all the things that are gonna go on top of the table. So very, very excited about that and yeah. That is all I got from the thrift store this time around, which was honestly a pretty good run for me because normally if I only go to two thrift stores, I'll probably leave with max three things. So I thought this was a really good thrift experience for today, but I hope you guys enjoyed. If you like this video and want to see more thrift hauls, please let me know in the comments. I know I love watching what people find from thrift stores. And if you guys do too, let me know and I'll do more of this. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video because that truly helps us out. And thank you guys so much and I'll see you guys next time. I'll check this out. It says June 1st, 1986 time on the picture at the bottom of the picture. I love that. That just brings me joy. I truly appreciate things like this. It was probably handmade too.